Hey guys, Shaggy here, aka G Unit. Welcome to a, a gameplay, and this, as you can see by the title, it says the clan that never got far. And as you see in the end of the gameplay, the clan tag is called K114, I believe. Now, as you can, oh well, if you have noticed this or not, I don't know if you have, but uh, my commentary has changed a lot because my nose is finally free of 250 uploads. I might. You might not see the difference yet, but I don't know. I see. It, I feel a big difference in my commentary, my voice. You know, because my nose is really free. I can start to speak normally. Now, the com the commentaries that I commentate for Machinima seem to be really dry. And what I mean by that, people think I got a blocked nose, and you guys, you guys might think I got a blocked nose too. But I'm living in an environment where I gotta live in carpet, in carpet, on carpet. Sorry. And in the carpet fills up with a lot of dust. I don't want to get into too much detail with the dust, what it contains in the carpet, because that's personal. Now, <laughs> so um, this gameplay pretty much UMP. Yes, I know it's UMP. You know, but I pretty much call it the scissors, the scissors. But just I find UMP as uh, let's say a baby gun. It's like a toy. Let's just call it a toy. The reason why I call this a toy is because basically it's like punching a baby in the face. Because the gun is pretty easy to use. And basically saying, if this gun, if I see this gun ever used in the search and destroy, I'm pretty much going to rape the child or whoever is playing with that UMP in search and destroy. I don't mind if they use it in ground war. Yes, it's a, yes, it's capable, you know, it's, it's okay if you use it in ground war. But if anyone uses it in search and destroy, I just get so mad. Because all it takes, literally two bullets. No, I'm just kidding, but it feels like it takes two bullets. Some guy's sitting in a corner. You're trying to go in for montage warbangs. You see a guy coming from the back, and he just fly kicks you in the face with two bullets. Come out of nowhere. Uh, I don't want to say the word, but like they'll say, "What? Get me? What? Okay. So um, basically, search and destroy, right?" You see anyone using the UMP45 silencer with the Marathon Pro, Lightweight Pro and the Commander Pro? Just give me a call. 0988175175. No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, so annoying. So annoying. So I'm basically trying to do some jump shots instead of the reverse drop shots. And um, I pretty much fail. But uh, you know, that's how it works. These guys, you know, they're pretty, pretty, pretty decent clan. Think. We're putting down claymores, very smart guys. Um, average age, let's say 12, 10, you know. Um, I don't know, but um, pretty, pretty decent. One guy sitting in the corner every the whole game, planting claymores and killing me. So, pretty, pretty decent clan, pretty organized. Pretty, they're communicating in the headsets, obviously. So, basically, I you know, I gotta work things out and reformate myself and see oh and I get a triple nader there we go and dodge this claymore here and uh okay, oh wait oh oh wait he's digging the ground with his claymore very interesting oh final stand very nice get okay, coming through oh, everyone support oh wait oh, oh wait wait what's it wait wait oh 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 okay so that, that was the most exciting part of that now what would you think their reaction should be Let's let's have a guess. Leave a comments below. What what do you think they would have said in their headsets right now? Oh, did you there? I did you. I did you. I'm just kidding. Okay. <laughs> okay, moving on. Basically, um, to uh, okay, reality speak now. Okay, playing with clans can be fun. Some occasions it will be so annoying when you see a lot of people like me would be running with UMP and. Knowing them, you know, it happens to you guys a lot, doesn't it? When you see some guy running with a UMP and smacking your face, which a lot of people criticize over. And some of this guy, this host is, has a really bad connection on the leaderboards, but it seems to be okay here. Okay, it's back to the green bar now. Now, um, just to cl clarify to everyone, what those bars mean for the connection doesn't mean anything. Well, from my experience, it doesn't mean anything because, firstly, Say for example you're playing on a two bar connection, it still feels like you're playing on a host connection for me for some reason. And it's still, still similar because it's so random the connection. The host's connection is so random. It sometimes goes to yellow orange bar, then it goes to the green bar. It's so random every second. 
but uh, you still seem to be in a stable connection. I'm not too sure if this goes for everyone else, um, but I'm just saying this from my experience. Um, I want to say for the English guys, I don't know if this is America, but if you have, I don't want to add, I don't want to advertise anything, but Talk Talk is the is the, is this type of brand, you know. Um, I'm not going to give any opinions about it, but in my opinion, I can't say it, but it's bum crack. Um, um, what did I say? Yeah, that's that's why I got I got Talk Talk, and I got to deal with it because my mom actually renewed the contract. I was trying to ch change it into Virgin Media for 200 megabytes. But I have to stick with this, which is out of speed, which is not sorry, not 200 megabyte speed, but 50 meg merging media. But talk talk is five megabyte speed. Upload speed is five megabytes. Not upload speed. I mean, download speed is five megabytes, and upload speed is 0 0.5 upload speed. It's basically, a 10 minute video takes me about, let's say one and a half hours now that is a lot I'm not gonna waste a lot of electricity on my computer but I guess my parents are paying the bills anyway but the thing is but the thing is it's so annoying because just just after the contract finished because we have to work, uh, live with contracts here with the um, internet provider or whatever you call it a company because we either have BT talk talk virgin I think you guys have virgin did don't you um, but Talk Talk is a cheap company. I think you pay like fourteen dollars a month, which is six pound here. I think average. I'm not, I'm not saying about accurate. I'm not too sure about the currency rate, right? but still. Um, yeah. So pretty much got I've got cheap internet. I don't know why I still get sometimes host connections. Uh, but um, yeah, gotta love it. Gotta take advantage of it. Um, so anyway, we're, we're pretty much domi dominating these guys. We keep pushing them at the spawn. Keep pushing them hard and pushing them hard. Pushing them so hard. Two days, I mean, two day scream, and um, basically, um, this is what I was explaining in the two nukes in one game in Storm by capturing A and B, to, and they have C, so they keep spawning at C, and they keep trying to come out the window. And we keep trying to, we keep just spawn trapping these guys and doing jump shots and failing. And oh gotta keep God. pushing and pushing, keep pushing harder. Um, and they keep coming one by one from Semtex, you get a lot of kills, but I get double from that. And they keep coming, a hit by a shot. Keep coming and coming and coming, keep coming on the faces, and get to keep going and going and going. And it never ends. You know, drama never ends. And pretty much these guys with the Kimbo's in my team, pretty faithful as well. These guys, my team, I've got to say, they're really good as well. So they really support me in order for me to succeed and defeat these, defeat these guys, you know, just defeat these clans. This clan, you know, I got another clan video coming up very soon. This uh, was in Team Deathmatch, pretty more, pretty immense as well. So anyway, 50 kills and 22 deaths, playing, you know, ground war, game and pretty fast there. So uh, yeah, K1L4, unlucky guys. Next time, maybe next time. Check it out. Say out. Good night, peace. Yeah. All right, lads. Make sure I follow me on Twitter. Yeah. All right, peace.